Hey guys, tambah balik lagi kita sekarang lagi menyerang balik See para bandits. Tapi nggak tahu bakal seru atau enggak. Kayaknya di episode 2 lebih banyak actionnya. Gak ada orang Tapi kayaknya bahaya kalau misalnya ngedeketin Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Jangan ada ada zombie. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Nothing but fumes. Shit. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? We don't know whose camp this is. Might not be bandits. It must be. They don't share their neighborhood. Ada dari mereka. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Masih hangat. Just water. Gua takutnya dari samping ni, bakal ada serangan. Nothing. Empty. Ada remote. Oh kamera. What you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then. Is there anything about what they have to do, Nick? I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Kayaknya punya keluarga deh. Soalnya tempat tidurnya juga buat anak-anak.
Tô bem a clem. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I begged them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. Hmm? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. <laughs> Spring them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. We ended it, huh? Sidani. God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. No. She pointed at me. <sighs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Fuck you. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Diambil aja. Tuh kan diambil. Sialan si Dani mah jahat. Tapi yang bingung dari mana aja dapat itu ya? Ibu itu dapat topinya sekalian ya? Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Okay, I'm down, down, what I I'll do it myself. Udah di tempat kayak gini masih aja berisik. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. 
Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Ini pada keluarganya mencurigakan gini ekspresinya. Nah, kleme. Nah, kenapa? Kenapa jadi malam? Emang mau hujan ni kayaknya. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Whoa! Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> hey there, Andy. Yeah? We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Um... When do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. <laughs> Thanks. Yep. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Uh, I'd like to someday. I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Gak ada apa-apa di sini. Kayaknya gak ada. Nah, ini ada nih. Enggak ada juga. <laughs> Harus ngecek satu-satu. Nah, ini. Empty. Looks like a bunch of old, dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. It's a feeding trough. Just some fence posts. 
Nah, baru kita terakhir ke pintu itu. Kayaknya ada sesuatu. Di episode kedua kali ini kayaknya lebih banyak yang disentuh ya. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? <laughs> well, you're... You know... Urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bank. <laughs> Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Oh. <laughs> so, how does a woman yeah. like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I are you you like it. <laughs> Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without him. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. <laughs> How do you put up with him? Look, 
My dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Gimana ya caranya distraksi Andy? Kayaknya nematiin mesinnya, Mak, mungkin. Ah iya. Access that. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. I guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Ah, gak cukup nganggu ya. Ada toolbox, toolbox maksudnya. That should be handy. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Kenapa dia nggak curiga ada orang yang ngambilnya? Kalau putus sih ya mungkin. Kenapa sih kalau kita masuk jadi malam cuacanya? Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Screws holding it to the door. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Mm, 
screws holding it to the door. If I can remove them, I don't really need to deal with the lock. Salah pilih, guys. Oke, okay, takutnya sih ada zombie di dalam ini yang bahaya. Kenapa dia mukanya kaget? Android ini apaan sih? Goblok. Massacre ini mah. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Look, I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idea, brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. <laughs> oh, Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Oke okay guys, sebelum kita lanjut uh, ke bagian berikutnya, thanks sudah nonton, makasih banyak, dan see you in the next episode. Bye.